Hello everybody, um, hope you're having a good day, if it's not, it's okay. I listened to a song yesterday, um, that I think the title says, it's okay, not, you know, it's okay to be not okay, something like that, it's okay not to be okay, yeah, something like that. And it, 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 today I woke up feeling kind of down and my day didn't start on a good note. Um, you know, disagreements here and there, business-wise, personally, and so forth and so on. And it kind of made me feel kind of sad. And as, as most of you may know, I don't know if you know that, I was diagnosed with depression last year, early last year, around Jan, and I've been dealing with it, and I don't believe it completely, completely, it completely goes away, but I believe you can improve, you can work on being better and positive. So today's one of those days where I felt this thing is not gone. But more than anything, lately I've been suffering from a very intense amount of anxiety. And I didn't know that anxiety could be a disorder until I saw some people on Facebook also saying, asking, do you guys suffer from anxiety? And I realized, I suffer from anxiety. I... I was telling my colleague, I was telling Lerato Khanyako the other day, yesterday, that I suffer from being constantly anxious and being scared of something that I don't know, also being scared of what might go wrong. Because at the moment, sometimes, at the moment, most of the time, my things are going so well. My career is going so well. My marriage is going well. My family is doing good. Um... I'm good, but there's this anxiety, guys. It is a joy stealer. So the reason why I'm sharing this with you, one, is for you to know that even the ones that seem the happiest and they've got it all together, I don't have it all together. I go through fears. I go through anxiety. I go through depression. I go through sadness. And one of my friends yesterday called me aside and he asked me if I've achieved everything that I've wanted to achieve and I said um, I've achieved almost everything that I wanted to achieve this year and he said what's that one thing that's still missing and I said I couldn't think of anything because I thought I got it all together and then he said to me Sumiz, I can see through you you look drained you tired maybe you're physically tired but you look emotionally tired did you give yourself enough time to mourn the passing of your mother and I'm like hmm I did not give myself enough time to mourn the passing of my mother. But however, I don't think that's the reason why I get this anxiety or I get this depression. It is just, I haven't fully dealt with it the way I'm really supposed to, or it's not gone, or I'm overthinking stuff. So, um, I'm a work in progress, and I hope you guys listening to this will also realize if you're going through the same thing that everybody they, they might not say it everybody has their amount of amount of a some sort of a level of depression some some sort of amount of anxiety some sort of amount of fear i get scared of, about my future i get scared about my finances i get scared about my life i get scared about my love life i get scared about the people that i care i get scared and it's okay not to be okay Tomorrow is another day. So today, after my last meeting, I thought, let me go to the gym. And then as I'm driving, like, no, man, hell no. I am not going to the gym. I'm just going to get home, um, pour a glass of champagne, um, watch tennis or watch something, and just not do anything, anything. Um, at the moment, I'm still alone at home, and I'm thinking, let me just use this time to just not do anything and not to worry about anything. Let me let go and let God, for now, 
anything that's going to happen is beyond my control but at the moment i can control my environment and my environment right now is to just not do anything just do me not go to the gym the gym is going to be open tomorrow i'll be fine tomorrow is another day tomorrow is a brand new day brand new opportunities for me to regain my joy my strength my power my fearlessness my positive attitude i'll be okay but for now it's okay not to be okay i love you have a wonderful day know that if you're going through what i'm going through you are not alone the biggest the most famous the most richest the most prettiest the most handsomest the most physically beautiful the most the most the most we, they go through the most okay